All right, testing one, two. Testing one, two, one, two. Welcome, y'all. Welcome, y'all. Welcome, y'all. Welcome, y'all. Name is Noel. I am here to read to you Isaiah 43, one of my favorite books of the Bible. Let's go ahead and get it started. Eternal One, remember who created you, O Jacob. Who shaped you, O Israel? See, you have nothing to fear. I who made you will take you back. I have chosen you, named you as my own. When you face stormy seas, I will be there with you with endurance and calm. You will not be engulfed in raging rivers. If it seems like you're walking through fire with flames, licking at your limbs, keep going. You won't be burned. Because I, the Eternal One, am your God. I am the Holy One of Israel and I will save you. I have traded in nations to win you back. Egypt, Cush, and Seba in exchange for your freedom. Because you are special to me and I love you. I gladly give up other peoples in exchange for you. They are trivial by comparison to your weighty significance. So don't be afraid. I'm here. I will reunite you with your children. Mm. Bringing them back from the east. Excuse me. Bringing them back from wherever in the world they are. East, west, north, or south. No place will be able to hold you when I demand your lease. When I ordered them, bring my children, my sons and daughters from far away. Bring the ones who are called by my name, the ones I made, shaped and created for my profound glory. Even though they fail to seem blind and deaf and not for lack of eyes or ears, bring them out. All the nations gather together People from all over the world assemble. Who among them could have foreseen this? Let them call their witnesses to make their case. Prove they are in the right, that it is the truth. Let's continue on to verse 10. Eternal one, you are my witness, you are my proof. You whom I chose for a special purpose my servant in order that you would know me trust me be faithful to me understand that I alone am God no God was formed before me and there will be no God after me amen I am I I am the eternal there is no savior except for me I alone told you that this victory would happen then I saved you and made it known. No other God worked among you. You know the truth. You can testify that it is so as I declare. I alone am God. Indeed, from day one, I am he. No one can wrest another from my hand. I can make things happen. Who can turn them around? The Holy One of Israel, the Eternal One who redeemed you says eternal one for your good I will send again send another against Babylon and make all of them outcasts from their own land the Chaldeans will set sail and try to escape on their celebrated ships for I am the eternal your holy one I am your king creator of Israel my people this is what the eternal one says the one who does the impossible the one who makes the path through the sea a smooth road through the tumultuous waters the one who drags out chariots and horses armies and warriors and drowns them in the sea they will go down never to rise again their lives are snuffed out by candle wick. 
and then we have a little footnote right there let's continue on eternal one do not reveal only the past or spend all your time recounting the victories of days gone by watch closely i'm preparing something new is happening now even as i speak and you're about to see it i am preparing a way through the desert waters will flow where there had been none wild animals in the fields will honor me the wild dogs and surly birds will join in there will be water enough for my chosen people trickling springs and clear streams running through the desert my people the ones whom i chose and created for my own will sing my praise in truth you never really called upon me did you jacob my people so how then could you be tired of me israel my own you don't present me with sheep for burnt offerings or acknowledge me in sacrifices i didn't tire you by demanding so many gifts of offerings and incense no sweet cane no money or glorious excess excess have you given to me you didn't even try to satisfy me with the fat of your sacrifices. Instead, you tired me with your sins, bloodshed and lies, crimes and offenses. You wore me down with all your belligerence and faults. So let's get this clear. It's for my own sake that I save you. I am he who wipes the slate clean and erases your wrongdoing. I will not call to mind your sins anymore. Now help me remember, let's get this settled. State your case and prove to me that you are right. From the very beginning, your founding father sinned. Then your leaders defied my laws and instructions. So I brought disgrace on your princes of the sanctuary, your priests. I turned them over to the barbarian assault leaving Jacob to the barterers, Israel to humiliation. May God add a blessing to the reading, hearing, and doing of his word, its word. Amen. Y'all take care. Remember, if y'all like this, uh, remember to like, comment, subscribe. <laughs> now nah, you ain't got to do nothing. Y'all take care, though. Stay blessed. We're going to justice for all the people assaulted by the police. Amen.